Towering over the crowd at the mall parking lot, firefighters from across Canada converged to the gas city for the 2011 FireFit Championship Finals. We've got a little over 200 people competing uh, from every province and territory except uh, Northwest Territories, Nunavut, uh, Yukon and Prince Edward Island. The rest we got covered and uh, yeah, like I say, over 200, probably about, uh, let's say around 40 locally. The strenuous course consisted of hoisting up 45 pound hoses, swinging hammers, water hose accuracy and hauling a 175 pound dummy 100 feet. Firefighters did all this in as fast a time as they could, something local competitors say is a mirror image of their job. Practicing working on the air pack, uh, doing different tasks, you know, the sledgehammer simulating, chopping a hole in the roof or uh, hoisting up uh, hose or, or running upstairs. Uh, just the athletic endurance that you can get, you know, it makes you be able to work that much longer, that much harder at a fire. The whole idea of this sport is to uh, promote fitness within the fire community as well as to showcase what uh, firefighters may do uh, for the public at a fire incident. Being a firefighter is said to be like a brotherhood among colleagues and meeting everyone was as important as the competition itself. A lot of guys have been in the sport for years and they stick with it because of the camaraderie. Uh, you know, I could call up a guy in every every province and, and stay at his house if we went on a family trip. Or uh, Yeah, and it's all about beating your personal best, but uh, at the end of the day, it's always fun to, to razz the fellow competitors. It's awesome. Like, you know, I have friends from all across Canada, so it's I couldn't ask for anything better. This weekend, the firefighters showcase their life-saving abilities by putting on a great show and once again giving back to the community. That's Medicine Hat on the Riello side. I hope so. Like this is great PR for the community, and you know we uh, we are very well respected by the community, so we always want to try to give back what the community gives to us. For Chat Sports, I'm Jesse Byer.